What's up guys? This is Cool Breeze and this is my first live commentary. This is Domination on Resistance and I'm using ACR Silence with extended mags and my perks are Scavenger Hardline Stalker and my specialist perks are Assassin, Sleight of Hands and Quick Draw. And I think I'm like in a about a seven or eight man party but this is not just the best gameplay but I just wanted to upload you know keep uploading games stay up to date with uploading games or whatever but um as you can see I run all the way around the map and there's nobody to kill because my teammates have killed everybody and I'm capping the B flag because you know I'm not just you know the guy to just run around and try to get all the kids I'm gonna cap flags too so you know you can't just call me a camper or I, just say I don't play the objective. I do try to play the objective. But um, there you go. You see Papashenko stealing my kill right there with a drop shot. And I got that kill. And I left this host migration in there to let everybody know that I was recording live and I didn't go back to my vault to get the gameplay or whatever. But um, like I said, this is almost as real as it gets. <laughs> and... Um, I'm just running around the map wide open, chest wide open, like one of my old football coaches say, just lay your ears back and run straight through them. That's, that's all, really all I'm trying to do. And I'm capping the A flag right now because we want, we really want to spun in at the C flag, but it's not, it doesn't work if you have everybody just running wild everywhere. But, um, uh, also, this is like one of my favorite areas of the map. This little mi middle street right here between the C spine and the uh, B spine or whatever. It's like my favorite little area on this map. But I just hate like all these vehicles up here. They haven't been blown up yet, and it that's like real scary because you know sometimes they just tend to just blow up out of nowhere. And that's an easy way to die. I don't know why they got all those cars like that piled up right there anyway. And I hip fire this dude, spray him down, get my specialist bonus. And they're usually spawning up there, but there's people in the back of the spawn point back in the behind there. So they're not gonna spawn right there. And this dude almost kills me right here, but I kinda bag off a little bit. And we got the green dudes and stuff on our team triple capping I really hate triple capping it makes the game go by too fast and you can't get the kills that you should get and then it also messes the spawn up they spawn people all over the place and I get this dude up there camping in a little sniper's nest that I call it and as you can see we got AC 130s Reapers and all this kind of stuff going and it's just smoking the map up. I don't know what he was back there doing. I don't, I, I'm surprised he didn't kill me. I guess he was just standing in the corner, digging in his nose or something. There's no telling what he was doing. But I was lucky to figure he was over there before he figured me out. And this is a good spot on, of the map, too. And as you see, I got the MP9 as my secondary. I throw a portable radar right there because this is a good area to get a lot of kills at because that's the B spawn point but my teammates are running all through it so it's not gonna really work and as you can see I catch these dudes spawning at the A flag capping the A flag and I get a chance to get a couple kills and maybe an assist so knock him down me and this dude right here we were kinda playing a little ring around the rose I got an assist on it he might have killed me if somebody else wouldn't kill him but I don't know and I run to the back of the spawn behind Papashenko. As usual, he's always somewhere near where they should be spawning. And see, he wasn't paying attention then and got knocked down by the dude sitting in the corner. And I go check behind me because they tend to spawn people right behind you in that little area right there when they've got the A flag. And I ran straight through that flag because there's no reason to cap a flag. We got a pretty convincing lead on them, so it wasn't it wasn't a big deal about capping that flag 
and I missed the guy going in the little gate right there. I, I don't chase kills. I try not to chase kills because once you turn your back focusing on one kill, then somebody else will run around the corner and shoot you. But I got a chance to get a couple guys spawning right there. And like I said, this is my favorite area of, of the map right in here. It's usually spawning back there, but no one is there. And the green guy just got killed right there trying to take take the A flag but I avenged his death <laughs> get a couple kills right here and a lot of people like you know cool breeze man what gun do you use what's your favorite gun I love the ACR it's accurate then it's got it's got pretty decent damage to it so you know I, and then I was an ACR fan in Modern Warfare 2 anyway so I pretty much, I think the ACR is my favorite gun, and I would say my opinion is it's the best gun on the game. I'm trying to get better at these commentaries and editing videos. I know I should have cut clips out of this video because it's not just full of action, but I don't know, I've been fooling around today and I really just didn't have time to try to figure all that out. And there we go, we triple cap again. So we have to just run around and try to get kills. And my control is acting crazy. It's, <laughs> I don't understand, it's like it's glitching out or something. It's crazy, it does that from time to time. Not all the time, but from time to time and it starts acting crazy, I don't know why. But um, I thought that was gonna get me killed, but I was able to fight through it or whatever. See, it's like pre-aiming on its own. That dude almost killed me. He had no chance back there in the back though. And that guy was just came flying out of the sky the reaper took him out and I catch him spawning in the back get assist get the moab call in the moab and I got this saying that like it seems to me once you call in the moab it's like your health gets put on minuscule because I don't know once you call in the moab it seems like it's so easy for you to die I don't understand I usually try to, I started trying to just, you know, hold my Moabs, but I don't know. It just depends on the mood I'm in or whatever. And I'm, I, my marksman is picking up a bunch of people in that build and I just sprayed it and I don't understand how he got me. See, that's one of those one bullet theories. And I also got caught on one of the many vehicles just in the way on this map. I got caught up against the car and my cell phone started ringing and I was getting text messages and I really wasn't paying attention and that dude was just sitting over there in the corner and he kills me and like like I say once you start dying man it's just it's almost an ongoing process and right there he caught me slipping I was checking the score I was trying to check the score I don't understand why I did that inside that house with all the action that goes on in that in that area, I don't know why, what made me decide to try to check the score real quick. And I get sprayed down right there. But I hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Shout out to Killer Kid, Cold Side of the Pillow, Blue Monkey Red, you know, all my friends. There's TRD and the AC-130 getting it in. And I got more, more videos, better gameplays, and more commentaries on the way.